Hi and welcome to MTG Mesh Group. Today we'll be looking at another weekly episode of the Silk Deck Simulator. And yes, we'll get three Tiros and three Bond of Guards boosters. And you will try to form a 40 card deck out of all these cards. And let's get started. So first I'll pull out all the bombs that I see. So first up we have our Forge Stoker Dragon 5-4 flying. And next we are looking at a Titan of Internal Fire. It is alright. Unfortunately the god that we had is Phoenix God of Deception. So although it is a mythic and it is a god, I don't really think that I'll be putting it in my deck. And yep. Grave Robber Spider is a uh, quite a good card. Furfrost Emissary is awesome and limited, making a creature sort of unblockable is good. Thunderbrute is a good card as well, sort of a bomb. Tazas Emissary and uh, Decorated Griffin is a good card. Decorating Griffin gives you good evasion and it is a 2-3 flyer for 5. Pillar of War is a okay card, I don't mind putting it in my deck. Architect of Endurance is a good late game, 6-5 for 7 if I'm not wrong. And Ordeal of Nelia is uh, pretty awesome. Any uh, any ordeals um, to be played in limited format is uh, really good. Gains you quite a bit of advantage. And next up, we are looking at Flitter Step Adelon 1-1. One, one. Uh, it can't be blocked and bestowed creature cannot be blocked as well. And next we have our Dawn to Dust. Return target enchantment from graveyard to hand or destroy target enchantment. Trident Tactics is a good card. But now we have sorted out all our bombs and uh, playable uncommons. Let's take a look at the colors and go through each of the cards and see what we can play from the other colors. So first up on our white cards, not that many playable cards. They have uh, some good removals like Last Breath and Dawn to Dust. But other than that, it's uh, nothing... Mm, really eye raising. And next, uh, we have a uh, blue card. Scripsis is good. Protection from creatures is a very good card. Often protecting your own creatures from damage and also a good finisher. Faithful Toad is a good card for drawing and taking out your deck. Shredder Swap gives your creatures evasion, so really, really good in limited format. Anything with evasion is generally a must pick in limited. Yeah, so um, sort of a brainless pick there. Sudden Storm, they've just uh, put it out, is good as well. And uh, Prisane Chimera is uh, another good evasion creature. And next on to our black deck or black card pool. Uh, Farikia's Cure is a very, very good removal. And so is the other removal card. But there isn't any other stuff that is playable in black, so I will not pick them for now. And on to our red, Spear Point Aureate is good. Borderland Minotaur is a good aggro creature as well. Faragax Fer Fer Giant. Faragax Giant is a sort of a bomb as well, uh, as well as a Titan of Eternal Fire. It's a late game creature that is hard to remove, so putting it in our deck uh, makes sense. And up next to our green, we have Leaf Crown Dread is a good card. A 2 2 Rich is not bad. And our artifacts, we have Fleet Feather, Sanders, Bronze, Sable, and Anvil Roth Raptor. Not much that I would want to pick, and so seems that we do not have much white or green, so I'll just be taking. The white and green cards out and looking through the white cards again, yep indeed there isn't much to play in white so I'll just pick out the cards that are green or white that I've previously picked. And yes, no more decorated griffin and so now it leaves us with 17 cards. I'll usually go with a 23 uh, spells and creature deck along with a 17 lens. So right now I'm looking for another 6 cards to put in. 
So Nick's Bond Rotico is a good one drop, and you can cast it for a bestow cost of only two. Impetuous Sun Chaser is a good evasion creature as well. Uh, Spearpoint Oriel is a good two two first striker. And on to our blue cards, uh, Nimbus Nayad is good. Flying is always good. Uh, we have our Nyx Bond Trident. It's a good filler card. And right now, for the last card, I'm looking at one more. And I might just go with Borderland Minotaur since we have quite a few spells ready. Yep. And so this is my pick. 23 creatures and spells out of a 40 card deck from this sealed pool and I have 6 spells in total and the rest are creatures quite a lot of creatures with evasion and I would say about all 4 of those red creatures are bombs Fox Stoker Dragon, Thunder Brute, Ferrogax Giant, Titus of Internal Fire and the rest of the red Aggro creatures are not bad as well. We have uh, quite a lot of uh, creatures with evasion from our blue cards. Namely, Nimus Dyer, Sphinx Disciple, Prison Chimera, and Coastline Chimera, which is a really annoying 1 5 flyer. So, yeah, and along with Crypsis, Trident Tactics, and uh, Shredder Swap, and Sudden Storm, I think this is quite a stable deck to play with in limited yes and that's it for this episode let us know what you'll pick in the comments below and if you like the support channel please do hit like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time